All right. Once again, I want to give all praises to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahushai, Bashem, Kakwadash, Tabalan has been the apostles and the others are great millstone. He told the Akims worldwide, I want to say Shalom be unto you. This is the word from the GMS Journal Camp. Let's build a quick qualification to the Spirit and the power of the Most High Hab Hashem Yashai. Manification today is entitled The Most High Hab Hashem Yashai is to be feared. And just want to bring out some self explanatory scriptures not fully explaining the fear and the terrible and the dread of the Most High Hab Hashem Yashai. No? They don't, need, they don't really need much breaking down. You know, it, it really explains itself. You know? I'll start out with Psalms chapter 76, verse 1 to 12. It said, In Judah, is Yahweh known. His name is great in Israel. Salem also is his tabernacle. And it's dwelling in place in Zion. They break he the arrow of the bow, the shield and the sword and the battle Silah. Thou art most glorious and excellent in the mountains of prey. The stout hearted are spoiled, they have slept their sleep, and none of the men of might have found their hands. And I rebuke your how of Jacob, would a chariot and a horse Ah, can't ah, cast into deep sleep. Thou, even thou, art to be feared, and who may stand in thy sight when once thou art angry? Thou didst cause judgment to be heard from heaven, the earth feared and was still. When Yahweh rose to judgment to save all the meek of the earth, see that. Surely the wrath of man shall praise thee. The remainder of wrath shall thou restrain. Vow and pee unto the Lord the Harbashim and Shire of Power. Let all that be round about him bring presence unto him that ought to be feared. He shall cut off the spirit of princes. He is terrible. To the kings of the earth. Hey, vow and pray, boy. As this God of Israel, as we serve Yahweh Hashem and Shai, hey, he's a terrible God and worthy to be praised. <laughs> so, what a God could boast, and you could hear so terrible, none. And this God you have Hashem is for Israel alone. You know? Israel is a people robbed and spoiled. You know, we scattered. Negroes, Latinos, and Native. We don't have an identity, we don't have a name. But we call upon our God a strong tower. Because he's to be feared. You know, right now all the Western nations over us. You know, they're ruling over us. It's a rod. You know, Psalm chapter 99 and verse 3. Let them praise thy great and terrible name, for it is holy. Yet the name of the Mosai Hamba is a holy name. It's terrible and holy. Hey, you know the terror of the Mosai Hamba Hey, you turn back from your ways. You turn back from your ways. Because you can't be you you can't be like a brute beast like the two tails of them right now. You know, they don't fear the Lord you have a shame and shine. Hey, but once in this truth and the power this 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 this, this tabernacle the most I have a shame and shine. You ought to fear the most high. You know? You ought to know to separate yourself. It's any time to be plain. Deuteronomy chapter 10 verse 17 said 
For the Lord Yahweh Hashem Shai, your power is God of gods and Lord of lords. He creates God power, he mighty and a terrible which regarded not persons nor take reward. Verse 18, I go along on the verse 21. He doeth execute the judgment of the fatherless and the widows, and loveth the stranger, and given him food and radiance. Love ye therefore the stranger, for evil strangers in the land of Egypt. Thou shalt fear the Lord, the Havashim, which shall thy power. Him shalt thou serve, and to him shalt thou cleave, and swear by his name. He is thy praise, and he is thy power that hath done all these great and terrible things which thy eyes have seen. Can, because hey, turn a new spirit upon us, it. A lot of us out there right now, hey, we was in Egypt and we witnessed what would have taken place out there. You know, and we're back here again. You know? A fear the most I have as Shemay Shai. It's a terrible God. Nehemiah chapter 9, verse 32 to 33. It says, Now therefore, our God, the Havah Shemay Shai, the great, the mighty and terrible power, who keepeth covenant and mercy, let not all the troubles seem little before thee that had come upon us, on our kings and our princes and our priests and our prophets and our fathers and all thy people since the time of the kings of Assyria unto this day. Howbeit that thou art just in all that is brought upon us, for thou hast done right but we have done wickedly. We didn't show you, hey, we deserve the judgment of the Mosai Hava Shemeshai. We deserve it. We, we are wicked. You know? The Mosai Hava Shemeshai is righteous and we wicked. But we, we, we got to praise the Mosai Hava Shemeshai and try our best to keep the laws and the commandments. You know? You have to set an example. You have to be a beacon unto the Gentiles. You know? We have to have them other nation and them being jealous. Because if we have to praise and you know, keep the laws as a command which has given unto us, Israel, the Negroes, Latinos, and Native, you know? Psalm chapter 47, verse 2 to 4. For the Lord, the Hav Hashem, is most high, is terrible. He is a great king over all the earth. He shall subdue the people under us and the nation under our feet. He shall choose our inheritance for us, the excellency of Jacob, whom he loved. In Psalm chapter 66 and verse 3. Hey, this, this, is, a, this is a terrible God. <laughs> None of God to be hey, playing with. Psalm 66 and verse 3. It says, Say unto power, how terrible art thou in thy works. Through the greatness of thy power shall thy enemies submit themselves unto thee. And we know you are Hashem Shai, you know. It's going to send back your Shai to subdue these men and them on earth here. These wicked men. These men are ruling in wrath. All these kings of the earth, all your kings of all these countries, who, you know, you, you just keep on oppressing Israel all the time. Mosai Hawashim Eshai seeing that, boy. And you wicked men will go and punish. You ain't gonna go and punish. Psalm chapter 145. And verse 6 said, And men shall speak of the might of thy terrible acts, and I will declare thy greatness. And we are declare the greatness of the Mosai Havashem Eshai. You know, he woke, he woke us up. 
A lot of us out of that sleep that we were in, out of that slumber, you know. Some of us woke, woke up. I know you're trying our best in great and marvelous name and the most I have a Shemeshai to walk in his will. And some woken up, and, but they're still in woken up as yet. They just wake up, but they're still sleeping. You know? Now is the time to wake up. Now is the time to smell the coffee and understand. You know, understand the tree and the truth that you're in. Be a true soul, you know, represent the name of the most I have, Hashem Isha. Isaiah 13, verse 9 11. It said, Behold, the day of the Lord, your heart, Hashem Isha, cometh cruel, both with wrath and fierce anger, to lead a land desolate, and he shall destroy the sin of the earth out of it. For the stars of heaven and the consolation thereof shall not give their light. The sun shall be darkened in its going forth, and the moon shall not cause her light to shine. I will punish the will for the evil and the wicked for iniquity, and I will cause the arrogancy of the proud to cease, and lay low the haughtiness of the terrible. Yeah. And nucleus and I'm popping off to they waste this land, this wicked place. But we don't want to be taking part in our lake of fire. But we want to be taking part is is the mercy and the glory of the Musa Habashim Shai. You want to be part of that righteous crew, not part of the wicked man. You know? Yeah, let's try to keep our garments clean you know renew your mind renew your heart which is your mind praise and save the terrible god you have Hashem yeah so i hope that's edifying without i want to give all praises to you have a Hashem Yishai Hashem Makankalash he doubled on us beyond the apostles and here as a great man stood he taught the account to the world and said shalom beyond to you so the word, she am a shalom, shalom.